Okay, now we're going to make a sugar mash here at Tom Lackey, with Tom Lackey. Yeah, okay. And here's how we do it. Uh, I'm going to make a weak sugar mash here, uh, which will give us about uh, 5 to 8 percent alcohol. By taking the first thing we do is all we do is I have about five gallons of water here. Okay, so I'm stirring up the water, and it's right around 80 degrees, uh, basically Hawaiian room temperature. So when I get that stirred, I'm going to add five gallons, five pounds. Five pounds. Five pounds. Now this okay. this will give us somewhere between six and eight percent alcohol. Six and eight percent, just by doing that just right by there. Doing that. And letting it set how long? Now we let it set, but now I have to add the yeast. So when I'm dissolving the sugar right now in the 80 degree plain good old tap water. Okay. Okay. That's just about it. Now the turbo yeast that we propagated from the old yeast, I'm just going to add about two cups here. That's it. Okay, and then just now does it gonna, set or? Now we're going to lit it. Lit, okay, with the with the this cap is, on there. That with the vapor lock. Vapor lock. Okay. Seal it all the way. Okay. Now it's sealed all the way. Valve is closed. Vapor lock is on, and we wait three days. Three days. Three days, and we'll have alcohol. Eight percent alcohol. Eight percent alcohol in that five gallons or that five pounds alone. Okay. Of, uh, of and sugar. It, how do we know that it'll be eight percent? Is will it be nine or will it be <coughs> it's, six? Uh, there's a basic formula. Uh, when I use five and a half gallons of water, and I use fourteen pounds of granulated sugar. It produces right around 15% alcohol, sometimes 60. If you let it go for a little longer until it's absolutely, completely dissolved, the yeast has eaten every bit of sugar in the, in the mash, it'll be 15, 18%. Okay, so that's done.